Hey guys, it's Carolina here from Carolina's Crafts and welcome back to my channel. Guys, I have a serious problem. I keep buying paper faster than I can use it up and craft with it. Like, why do I keep doing this? You guys just saw my like Michaels haul. I just bought like 12 paper pads. And then um, I went to Tuesday morning today and they had a new shipment of stuff. And then I bought some more. So, because I'm a paper addict, I'm going to show you guys what I purchased. So let's get right into it. So here we go, guys. So some of these are doubles. Not realizing that I purchased doubles. I was like, babe, can you check to see if I have any doubles and then get rid of any doubles? And he did. But when he looked at the doubles... So for example, he looked at these two like this and he was like, okay, yeah, they're different without flipping it over. <laughs> so I have a bunch of doubles, guys, but it's okay. I just have a lot of stuff to craft with and the doubles are mostly like fall and Halloween, uh, mostly fall. And you guys know I love fall, so I'm not that upset. <laughs> okay, so there's this paper pad that I purchased. It's the Simple Stories Fall Farmhouse Paper Pad. And this is the 6x8 size, and it was $4, and I didn't realize it was opened, so I hope that there's no pages missing here, but I think there was, like, one falling out. Yeah, so, like, or a couple were, a few of them are, like, falling out of here. I didn't even realize it was opened, so I hope I have all the pages. Let me see. So here's one, two, three, four five okay so we have all the pages and that was also my flip through for you guys so you guys got to see all the pages in here and then let me show you. Hold on, because I do have the 12 by 12 size of it, too. So here we go. We have the 12 by 12. I'm going to open up one of these for you guys, because it's the same thing. And I got two of them, not knowing that I did that. Um, so we just got a lot to craft with this. But let me show you guys everything that came in here. Because I love when they come in, like, packs like this. So I got the ephemera and you got a bunch of ephemera, you got little um, pumpkins, trucks, sweaters, this banner that says fall, really, really cute um, pieces and I always need more like fall things. So they're just cute little like ephemera pieces, leaves and wreaths and um, this thingamabobby and flowers, you could always find a way to use them especially if I'm making cards and stuff and this one says oh gather I thought it said gobbler for some reason <laughs> blessed and thankful like I can make some um I can make some um Thanksgiving cards with it too and then this says you pick pumpkins happy fall y'all little wagon and pumpkins and apple oh I like this bow and then there's oh my dog it says grateful so just really cute um, ephemera pieces. This one says autumn. So, you know, really cute ephemera pieces and they're not too big, which I am happy about. There was like a couple of big ones, like this um, last one. Like, what is this? A rolly door or something? Um, so, you know, a couple of big ones, but mostly they're on the smaller side. So um, they will definitely come in handy. Okay, so I got that. Okay, so that was in there, and then there's this chipboard piece, um, and if, oh yeah, this is the Fall Farmhouse collection, I think I said that. This is a chipboard piece, um, so you have like a truck, so uh, this thing is just so very blessed, harvest, flowers, a banner, this is a pumpkin wagon, harvest again, I love this heart, a candle, leaf, pumpkin spice, fall, so just like a cute, um, a whole bunch of like, um, fall chipboard ephemera, and then... You also get the sticker sheet. So it comes with all of these goodies. 
more fall stickers and I love all these word ones down here so great for embellishments and then here's the paper that came with it so you get 12 sheets of double-sided paper this one has some cut aparts I wore a shirt today that says pumpkin kisses and harvest wishes and I couldn't pass up this paper pad and I love this pumpkin pie hot cocoa and crisp apples pumpkin spice apple cider cozy sweaters falling leaves and warm memories well, I definitely had warm memories today because it was hot. So if I'm talking temperature wise, it was hot. And we went pumpkin picking. Um, I didn't have any pumpkin pie yet. I didn't have hot cocoa. I bought some apples. Pumpkin spice, I've been in pumpkin spice mode. Apple cider, I got some today. I've been wearing cozy sweaters when I can. So I don't know, I love it. I love fall, y'all. <laughs> oh, and more cut aparts. I never met a pumpkin I didn't like love it um then there's this one with more cut aparts i'm so glad i live in a world where there are octobers yes even though i went pumpkin picking in september i find that the best time while the pumpkins are still on the vines um then there's this one with little cut aparts or i could use the other side same thing with this i could cut it up or i could just use this side there's this one I love this side with the pumpkin papers. There's a striped one. Love the leaves, the orange leaves. There's this one with these wreaths. This one with this. Just a whole bunch of words. Polka dots with the plaid. Um, more plaid with flowers. Then there's these polka dots with these flowers. And that is it for this collection. It's a very fall and festive. You know what, I think I might just put this into like um, an envelope thing. Okay, I'm just gonna stick it into this envelope. I know they're not 12 by 12 size, but this is what I do with um, all of the things that have like pieces that go with it like chipboard and stuff so there's that okay so then I got this collection as well and this is another one by simple stories called autumn splendor and again it's got like the same idea here and again I got two of those not realizing that I got two of those and let me show you guys what's in here okay so this one has these chipboard pieces fall fun some pumpkins some leaves Festive Fall, Pumpkin Spice, One Fine Day, So Splendid, The Best Glorious Autumn Days, Fall, Fresh Picked, Spiced Up, this says Autumn, Happy Fall, this little like banner thing, another pumpkin. So there's the chipboard for that. And then there's some ephemera pieces, and these are a little bit more green than the other one, but still very fall and festive. So this one has got like um, this sunflower you got this that says hello harvest oh i really like this piece and it looks like a like a fake um button on there it's really cute you have this leaf this leaf just like a whole bunch of like decorative pieces layering pieces i love the word ones fall colors autumn glory happy days pumpkin spice this little ticket um whatever this is i'm not sure um, just, yeah, at the patch, pumpkin spice and everything nice, just a bunch of, like, obviously fall, um, pieces, because it is a fall collection, so I got that in, um, part of this, I guess, kit thing, and then there's the sticker sheet, it looks like this, lots of words and ticket things and just things embellishment pieces. I love the little bingo card for layering. Um, so a whole bunch of fun stuff on here. And then here is the paper. So I love this one, even though it also kind of looks like Halloween. And then some cut aparts on the back. Like this one is like more, I want to say like vintagey and watercolory, more than like more than I normally like, but um i needed to get it because it's fall themed and i have no control when it comes to fall and this is more cut aparts here then there's this one with this cut apart sheet on the back 
Then there's this polka dot one with the smaller cut apart sheet on the back. There's the flowers. And then this um, sheet right here. Then there's this polka dot one with these flowers. There's this one, definitely be definitely more vintagey than I normally do. This one, oh, I love this page. This would be great for scrapbooking. I love it. Then there's this leafy one with this and this one. Love this pumpkin page. Oh, I love this one too. Then there's this one. It's got like little butterflies in it as well. And then like this wreath here. And that is it for that collection. Okay, so let me put this one away too. But then with this, this was only $5 and you get a bunch of sheets. I want to say that there's 24 in here. I'm not really sure because I haven't opened it. But it's all the same um, pieces of paper and they're all double sided. So I liked this a lot because this would be great for, you know, to cut out these cut aparts and use them on cards, like sympathy cards and stuff. But they're not like sad. They are more positive and I guess hopeful. Um, trying to get you to look at like the memories and things. So I really liked it. Um, so it says always in my heart. Love, love, love. Thinking of you. Together forever. Those we love can never be more than a thought away for as long as there's a memory they live in our hearts to stay i love that so much love it is hard to forget someone who gave you so much to remember so i could use this side of cut aparts or i could use this side of cut aparts and there's this one i love up here that says when someone you love becomes a memory the memory becomes a treasure i thank my lucky stars for you thinking of you um a lifetime of love and memories it's just really cute. Missing you. Um, so it's like a really pretty um, paper pad by Simple or Papers by Simple Stories. And I don't even know what collection this is. Oh, this one, this one, this one is called Heart. But I don't know like what collection it's from, but it is called Heart. And there's the item number. And then I also saw another one that looks similar and it's from the same collection. Um, but this one is a different paper and I love this one as well. So look at this. It says... If there ever comes a day when, when we can't be together, keep me in your heart. I'll stay there forever. And that's by Winnie the Pooh, and I love Winnie the Pooh. But it's also just such a, such a beautiful quote. Then there's this one that says, Because someone we love is in heaven, there's a little bit of heaven in our hearts. Um, how lucky am I to have something that makes saying goodbye so hard? And I just love it. And this one also is double-sided. And like I said, I get the same sheet. So I could bulk make a bunch of the same cards. I wanted to make some for my shop. So I could make a bunch of like the same ones. Because I have a ton of the cut aparts now. And then there's this one on the back. I love these as well. Goodbyes are not forever. Goodbyes are not the end. They simply mean I'll miss you until we meet again. Like it's so beautiful. And then this one says no longer by my side but forever in my heart. And then I'll hold you in my heart until I hold you again. So it's like really pretty um, paper. And then to go with that, let me show you guys. I bought this paper. And this one is also in bulk. But I was going to use it with this side here. Because it goes with the colors of it. So I thought I could use this as like the backgrounds. And then put the cut aparts on top of it. And then just decorate a little bit. Because otherwise this is a Halloween paper by American Crafts. And it's called Bootyful Night or Fright Night. I'm not really sure which one it is. One says Bootyful Night, one says Fright Night, but there's the item number. Um, so here's the back side of that, and this is totally Halloweenish. But then this side, I just thought it kind of goes with um, that paper. So I picked those up, and then I also got this Simple Stories um, kit. So there's this one and actually did I get like, like I got two simple stories kits but this one looks like it has a stencil. Oh wait a second. Oh wait this one has chipboard and this one doesn't have chipboard but it has a stencil. That is so interesting but they both have the ephemera and the paper. So I mean this stencil is easy for you guys to see so I'll just show you guys that. But um, then I got the chipboard as well. 
and I did buy this. I thought this was like a new collection from this year. Isn't it? Like I was so surprised to see this at Tuesday morning. So let me show you guys the paper or in the chipboard. So here's the chipboard. So here's the chipboard. It says Happy Halloween. You got this bottle here, the banner, the ghosties, the tombstone, the trick or treat, the spider webs, the flowers, skulls, pumpkins, 31. And it's like really pink and beautiful. It's the Happy Haunting collection. You have the ephemera. And this is what comes in it. I feel like I showed this in another video because I did buy this collection already or I bought bits and pieces of it. But here is what it looks like. Trick or treat. Too cute to spook. So cute. Fright night. Eek. Um, chills and thrills. Literally dying. Um, creeping it real. Pumpkin season. Bootyful. And the Boo Crew. Lots of words, which I love in here. Lots of words. This one has like a little ephemera piece for layering. Something wicked. Double, double, toil and trouble. Got lots of like word things, which I love. Lots of smaller pieces, banners, um, all that stuff. And happy haunting. The bigger pieces are like some tags, but none of them are like too big. So you could still use them as layering pieces. So this is a good size ephemera as well. I feel like... Crate paper has been doing super large ephemera lately, um, whereas everybody else has been, you know, toning it down and making smaller pieces. So hopefully crate paper will get on the same page eventually. But yeah, there's that. And then for the paper, um, let me flip it. So here's the sticker sheet. I know I definitely showed this in another video. Here's the sticker sheet. I love the words down there as well. Then you have this spiderweb paper with the cut aparts. You have this chevron paper with these cut aparts. The floral with these cut aparts. Then the polka dots with these smaller cut aparts. Lots of cut aparts. <laughs> but obviously, I could only use one of them, depending on which side of the paper I want to use. Love this one. And I love this one as well, the side. And there's this one with this. It says Halloween, October 31st, monster, skeletons, eek, goblins, just a whole bunch of like Halloween words. These polka dots with these stars. Then these like leafy things with, I love this one as well, with these flowers. I love, 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 love this plaid. Is this plaid? I don't even know. Um, with the stripes this pattern with some red spider webs these polka dots with these bats so that's what you get in the happy haunting kit but i didn't even realize until now that they are different because one of them has the um you not the ephemera piece one of them has the um the stencil so i didn't even know that until now um then i got Oh, I got still two more. Let me do a flip through of this. This is the Pebbles Merry Little Christmas kit. Or not kit, but paper. Um, so this is the flip through. It's single sided paper. These are little hearts. Cut aparts. I almost feel like I have this, but I feel like I have not the full paper pad. I haven't even gone through my Christmas stuff yet. So I guess I'm about to find out what I do have. And I just keep buying more without looking at it. I feel like I need to make a list and keep it on my phone of all the collections I do have. Because I feel like I'm rebuying things. Anyway, then there's this coffee collection they had by Echo Park. And it's called Coffee. And I saw this the last time I was there and I didn't pick it up. But then I saw the Posh Paper Lady. Um, she was using this in a project. And I was like, mm, okay, maybe I should pick it up. So... It had these stickers here, and I'm happy they still had it because it was the only one. So these cute little like coffee stickers, like may your coffee be strong and your Monday be short. So cute. I just think it's a really cute coffee collection. Um, what does it say? When life gives you lemons, give them back and tell them you want coffee. <laughs> that is so funny. Okay, so then this has like this paper. Oh, I guess there's two of these in here. 
Okay, so there's two of these. Which I don't like this paper on the back, but I do like the pink. This is nice. Um, then there's this one. I guess you get two. I didn't even know this. So two of these flower ones, and then this is like a cut apart sheet on the back, which means I could just use either side, if I, especially if I like both sides. Like this one, I like the stripes, but then I also like these cut aparts. Follow your heart, but always bring coffee. Coffee is always a good idea. Life happens, coffee helps. OCD, obsessive coffee drinker. Like these are cute. So there's that as well. Then there's this one that has the green and the flower, not flowers, I guess it's flowers, like a ice drink and hot drinks um, kind of coffee cups. Then there's this one. And then on the back you have these flowers. And there's this one again with some like travel hot coffee cups. And this is, oh, you only get one of those? Okay, so then you get that. Oh wait, you get two of these. Oh, but one of them is, I guess, like single-sided. So these are the same, but then this one doesn't have that flower, this this piece on the back. So there's that um, in that collection kit, I guess. So this one doesn't come with much else of anything else. It was just the coffee stuff and the paper and the, the sticker sheet, but it didn't come with um, ephemera or anything. Then I got this one, this is the last thing I got, and this is a Christmas collection by Echo Park, and this one's called Merry and Bright, and I feel like I have this one as well, but apparently I don't know what I have anymore. Um, I just, I really need to just stop buying, but I can't stop buying. When I see like new stuff at Tuesday morning, like I can't do it, I don't know why. I just have all these plans to create with it and then I just don't have enough time to create all the things I want to make. And I know we all have that problem, but I just like, I don't know. I'm also kind of, I guess, just wanting to buy it all because I wasn't paper crafting at um, this time last I mean, this time last year. I like I was just starting and I didn't even know what Tuesday morning was until October last year. So it hasn't even been like a whole year yet. And I know with like COVID and everything, they haven't been getting a lot of shipments in. Um, so, you know, this is like the first time that I was actually able to buy a lot because they had a lot. <laughs> okay, so then there's this reindeer. And this one has two sheets for each one as well. This has got pink Santas on the back. Then you got the little cars with the Christmas trees and then the cut aparts on the back. Then you got these holiday lights with these presents on the other side and then the snowflakes with oh I like this one on that side then you got this minty one just this one of this one and I love this but I only get one and then the other side is the cut apart and then this one has like the front cover so I could always cut this part out This is merry and bright and still use that um, if I wanted to fussy cut, but I'll probably just use this one for the cut apart and use this one for the sheet. So there's that. All right, guys. And that is it for my haul video. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I don't know where I'm putting any of this, but I mean, you buy it and then you just, I don't know it becomes a mess in your craft room because there's nowhere to store it. I'm sure I'm not the only one with that problem, but I couldn't say no. So there's my haul, guys, my Tuesday morning haul. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next crafty video. Talk to you soon. Bye.